this is how to use live effects in Adobe Illustrator. So essentially what live effects are, are the ability to take an object that's on your Illustrator artboard and apply an effect to it that does not actually change the object itself. That way you can alter the effect and change the appearance of the object, but the object stays the same. So we're gonna take a rectangle over on our tools panel, I'm gonna drag it out, we can change it to any color, we're gonna make this one a red. And we are gonna find some effects. Now in the top of your window, in your menu panel, you'll see the effect menu. And if you scroll down, you'll notice there are Illustrator effects and Photoshop effects. The difference is Illustrator effects are fully scalable because they're vector effects. Photoshop effects are bitmap effects, so they can get blurry or they're not gonna scale completely with the size of your artwork. So we'll go into an Illustrator effect. And let's say we want to, let's say we wanna change it to scribble. Let's slide this over and we'll click preview. And if you look in the window, you'll notice that there's now a scribble effect on this. Now what this did was, all it did was create a scribble effect appearance. It's not actually changing your default shape. So we're gonna click OK because this is a live effect. And when we click this, it might be hard to see and I'll change the color to a yellow, but the red box is still around it in the shape of our original rectangle. So we can actually click this. Let's say we want to change the shape to something else. The live effect will say the same but we can still change the shape so that it still applies. So we'll grab one of the anchor points using the direct selection tool. We're gonna grab this one, we're gonna pull it out. And you see the live effect continues to mold with the shape, no matter what the shape is. Let's add an anchor point with the plus button. And we're gonna click that anchor point after we've clicked on the line segment, and we're gonna pull it up. And we still have the same effect different shape. And with live effects, you can remove it. Let's go back to our original rectangular shape. And if I wanted to show it as a solid color again, I can simply remove the live effect. And the way you do that is you can either go to your layers panel and you open the layer with the effect that's on it and you click the circle and drag that appearance from that circle into the trash can and it removes it. Or you can go into your Appearance panel, you can click Window, Appearance, and it will come up on your right window panel area. And then you look for the item that you wanna get rid of, which is Scribble, and you can drop that in the trash can and it will get rid of it. Now, if you wanted to ever go back in and you wanted to change the live effect, in your Appearance panel, you go to the item like this where it says scribble and we click that and that'll bring up our scribble menu and we can change our settings and this goes for any live effect so it's not limited to just this and that is how you work with live effects in adobe illustrator